Welcome back to the Nerd Network, everybody. My name is Ben. And we're here, and I'm John. And today, we're going to be opening these blue doors. Well, thank you for joining us here on the Nerd Network. Please <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next yeah, one. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Whoa! Uh, these aren't obvious at all. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh, no. I would have tripped on those. Ah! Are they like explosives? Yes. Oh! oh! <laughs> <laughs> that was the real trap! They knew we'd see those and not be aware of the sense. Someone deactivated the laser mines. Quick, Hello? all the synths. Telephone. Maybe we can call in an airstrike to take out all these synths that are underground. Please. <laughs> talk and babble. Oh, is there something in the room with us? There's like red dots. Oh. There's a door here. So there's probably some synths on the other side of this door. Ah! <laughs> we hit 19! Yay! Not bad. <laughs> God, leader, no. so vulnerable. Ah. Oh God, that could have gone better. Uh huh. Jesus, my God. Whoa, what is all that? Whoa, that's a, a new pistol from the mod. What's in his? What is that? Those are just like armor. Oh, synth armor. Not much better than what we have. That looks modded. All like long text always seems like it's a modded thing. It does, but I think that's actually legit. What's this excited thing? This is a new thing. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! That's what the sound was. Can we use this gun? Let's use this gun. That's awesome. This is cool. All right, let's hope it. Oh, oh <laughs> Deacon you... nearly got blasted. Deacon almost got a. Oh! Do we already have this crossbow? Oh, we just have a regular crossbow, right? We just have a yeah. short crossbow. Okay, we'll take the recon crossbow. Yeah, sweet. Tommy Whispers didn't make it out. He died protecting our secret. Tommy Whispers. There. Tommy would want <laughs> I could not have been more disrespectful. <laughs> oh, why would he want us to have the gun? We never met him. Why are you giving this to me? Our best agents carry special ordnance made by Tinker Tom. He's... Well, you'll know when you meet him. We met him! We met him! What? That's a good bats gun. 25% less action points. Okay. That's going in the pocket. Mm -hmm. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. Okay. How do you know that he died protecting his secrets? How do you know that? There we go. A good question. They could have tortured him and he could have broke. <gasps> mini nuke! Mini nuke! We finally have one. We finally have a mini nuke. I'm surprised we haven't found more. Hazmat suits. We should probably take one hazmat suit just in case we ever go back into the. It's a good point. I think that's where I got mine in my original playthrough. I remember like picking up one here. Hey, can we upgrade this gun? Well, we might as well since we're here. Let's try. Um. What does excited do? Uh, improves oh. critical shot damage and accuracy. I mean, I'm not opposed. We, we have to have a higher science ranking. Oh. Because these guns are pertaining to science. Is this a base game or is this modded? This is, oh, this is modded. This is modded AF. I'm about to say, that looks kind of lasery. It's modded. Kind of like the is, alien blaster. Yeah, this is... That's like a Star Wars noise. <laughs> that came straight from the, uh, New Hope. <laughs> that sound effect. Oh. Ah! Ricky! You f Ricky! You f that Ricky. was Ricky! <laughs> Ricky! But not now, Ricky! <laughs> we met before! <laughs> Ricky's over there Please. flipping minds over. Did we save? No. Yes, I think we did. <laughs> okay, we saved here, so... Might as well do the dialogue. I mean, what does the recon crossbow do? Uh... uh I am... Mm. Let's get it out and check if you want me to. Uh... Inventory. Recon crossbow. We have ten... Whoa! Right. That's a lot of damage! It's like one... Whoa! It's a sniper! It is. This would be great with vats. But I'm gonna carry the pistol. Okay. But if we ever need to vat something... Oh yeah, we'll use that. At, like, long distance. This is a spammy pistol. Look at the clip size on this thing! Dick, it's like the Boom Hilda. From Black Ops. 
Yeah, from Black Axe. I love doing him though. I appreciate it. May it serve you. Grab Carrington's crow. That was kind of dark. <laughs> Better than it ever did to Tommy. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's that's kinda dark, pretty Deacon. messed up, Deacon. Mini nuke. Can't forget that. All right, now let's save. Freaking, what's this? We're going to have to disable those mines as we're walking, aren't we? Probably. Yep, exit. Uh, I don't think Ricky made it this far. Ricky's probably dead in a ditch somewhere. <laughs> Ricky probably died getting here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't... Yeah, Ricky's probably dead. I hope he's alive, though. I hope we don't find a dead Ricky like at the end. I hope he's alive and all they did was capture him and shave his mustache. <laughs> We should probably heal before we go any further. Oh, Why yeah. are there no mines? I'm so scared. I think they're there. I just don't see them. We're not setting them off. I don't think we see them. They're there. I don't like it, John. I don't like it. Uh, where's my water? There it is. There. There's no mines. What? The <laughs> I'm so timid. Is someone present? Yes. Blast him. Woo! That's not a bad pistol. It's fun. It sounds Star Trek-y. It feels so satisfying. Look at that reticle. Whoa! <laughs> this is great! Wait, what was in the box? Beatrice. No! What box? How am I going to break this to Drew? What box? Uh, there by the uh, the pillar. And then in that little cardboard box. Right there. Institute oh. pistol. Nothing great. It like burst open and I was like, what is that? Level oh, up. we need the terminal to... Oh yeah, you want to do that? Yeah. What do we want? What do we need? Well, I forgot we're buff AF. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, we could do master locks now. We could do that. That works. I love master. I love lock picking. So, there we go. I'm sorry. I just love. No, lock dude. Yeah, and we've it's come super across beneficial. so many. We've come across so many locks that we're mastering. We'd be like, shit. In my original playthrough, I never bought from a vendor once. Damn. Because of. My upgrading of locking, picking skills, and whatnot. That's impressive. Yeah. We should probably also turn off the turrets. Oh yeah, good point. Let's do that. Deactivate. Please. Okay, now we're good. There we go. Loading screens disguised as elevators. Guess Deacon just doesn't want to walk in. And in five seconds, they'll magically appear. Oh. Loading screens as I... Just ahead and as... Ah! Deacon's behind us! Wait, is that a bookshelf? What? What? What is this place? What if we were come down here before and accidentally found... <laughs> this. Found where we just came from. That would be like, whoa. I would be like, whoa. Piper would be like, whoa. See? <laughs> She's um, pretty whoa. All right. What? What? We're that, just I guess... What? Wow. What? <laughs> okay, then. Deacon's mission was easy. Yeah. Just walk in there, get some dope-ass loot, and walk out with this cool Star Trek pistol. Yeah, this is the best... Oh. And he hands us an asp with the silencer. He's like... He would have wanted you to have his hand cannon, and we're walking around with a Star Trek pistol. <laughs> pew, 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 pew. <laughs> oh, yeah, thanks. I'll take it. Put it right in the pocket. Throws it in the trash can on the way out. These Zetans are said to be armed with powerful energy beam weapons that can completely disintegrate ent entities. You could find an alien in this game. Somewhere. I know. Is it a Zethian? Uh, yeah. Sure is. All right, we out. I think we out. It's in... <laughs> we disabled the turret. There's nothing to worry about. Sent hello. This is... Oh, these are the dead scents that Ricky must have taken Ricky out. took out two scents. <laughs> He's wow. going to be outside and I'm going to be so sad. <laughs> he didn't even kill them all. Oh, we need to make a song for Ricky. I thought we deactivated turrets. Back up, back up. You're hitting the wall. Oh. Thank you. I thought we deactivated the turrets. I thought we did too. What the heck's up with that? Piper's just getting laid in too. <laughs> did uh, it? There's so much blood on the wall. 
go ahead and save. There's going to be a dead Ricky out here. I'm, it's going to break my heart. Ricky? 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 Let's split up and meet back at the catacombs. Okay. We made a good team. The best. See you soon. All right. That was kind of dismissive. Is that Ricky on the ground? Wait. We were standing on Ricky. No! no! <laughs> I knew it. He went in there with a knife. What an idiot. You're a freak. You're... Can't... Can you not blow people's heads off with this? I guess not. Uh, can we take his sniper rifle? It's it's tuned. Okay. Is a serrated combat knife worth anything? No, but we'll take it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want it. I I want it to remember Ricky by. Yeah, fair enough. Whenever we look at that combat knife, we'll, we'll, knife will think, wow, Ricky was a freaking idiot. Do you think that he used that knife to shave? Yes. <laughs> Beware the manhandler. Whoa. 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 $39. Whoa. <laughs> Inflation, am I right? What the hell? Bounty. Oh. 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 Oh, he's oh. got a, He's got an anchor on his arm. She's going to kill him. And get that bounty. That's why she's called the manhandler. Oh! She's a pretty lady who lures in the men. And wow, that spiked the audio. <laughs> <laughs> I get it! Ah. Look at that smug-ass grin. That's so fucking smug. I know! <laughs> that could not have been more smug. Like, oh. there's smug, there's hella smug, and then there's so fucking smug. That you're just a butthole, and that's her. That, that was... Be, like her lower chin was like disconnected and further out. She looked like the crimson chin <laughs> with her smug ass face. And he's the bronze kneecap with Valley. his bronze kneecap. Oh yeah. We, oh duh. I know why we're here. I'll be real with you. I don't know who, who what the bronze kneecap is. Oh. Oh yeah. You didn't really watch a lot of Fairly Odd Parents. Nope. Yeah. He's the uh, villain from the com the Crimson Chin comic okay, book. Okay. So all I know is the Crimson Chin. Yeah. It's like everybody knows about that if you know uh, yeah. about Timmy Turner. Yeah, or yeah. Fairly Odd Parents. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, he Ron was his... Cap was the villain from that comic book. He was a very bad villain. Was he bad at being a villain? He was bad at being a villain. Oh, okay. And the new girl patched me up, put me on her shoulder, and blasted her way through the rest of the complex. Where the fuck did Deacon's hair go? Carrying you the whole time? Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Deacon told me you single-handedly <laughs> Carrington's point. Basically. Disabled a mind and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. So yeah, basically. True? <laughs> Let's go with Deacon's lie. <laughs> Every word he said was true. And then said, the full hundred. I, I can't even imagine. See? She's so stupid. Oh, Piper, get over it. <laughs> I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign her up, Des. You certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's Deacon's a lot less attractive without his hair. Yeah. <laughs> that pompadour. Cool. Let's do it. Let's do it. It's neat and all. Build me a teleporter. Yeah. Now we talk to Tinker Tom about building us a teleporter. I think it's Tinker Tom. Maybe we talk to Desdemona. But do we get a name? Huh? Do we get a name? <gasps> we get a code name? Oh! Want a code name. <gasps> code names aren't optional. All John! I meant that I wanted one! It's the Y button. And those close to them. More options. Because there's a fixer and the professor. No. It doesn't work like that. Alright, so we can either do the fixer or the professor. Or the char oh. bullseye whisper or charmer. What do you like? All right, follow with me here. Charmer because we're pretty suave. Mm -hmm. Whisper because that's kind of edgy as fuck, and then Bullseye because we got that dank ass laser pistol. <sighs> A response would be appreciated. Call me Bullseye. From what Deacon says of your fighting skills, Bullseye <laughs> seems apt. Your yeah. official order is to deliver Doctor Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. But first, 
It's time to meet the rest of the gang. We already did. We already did. Oh. Well, we talked to them on our own, but we were never formally introduced. God dang it. never can tell when you're being watched. Yeah. And now we could permanently uh, uh, fast travel to the railroad. Okay, that's we good. We don't have to walk through the church every time anymore. That's pretty good. I'm pretty happy about that. Mm-hmm. Hashtag benefits of joining the rep. Okay. Door? Okay. Thanks, game. Doors are hard. Uh, doors are hard. <laughs> Alright, so now we just have to go around and introduce ourselves to all the people, right? Mm -hmm. Dang it. And then... Oh, boy. I love these missions. So glad they exist. Yep, see? Now I'll fast travel here. That's pretty dope. And now we can take everything in here. I'm, br I'm okay with this. They do have a lot of loot, I'll be real with you. They really do. A bone cutter. Yes. Nobody thought to get this body out of here? I guess not. Oh! What is it? C3PO! Oh. <laughs> it's a Cybertron or whatever it's called. I can't remember what it's called. But... <laughs> it's an Autobot! Why was Piper sprinting around back there? Extraordinary <laughs> feature. Without a lick of training, and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command. But what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. I don't like this guy. Watch the attitude. I don't know if I should say that. I don't want to. Oh. To business. Tell or, me what you yeah. need, Doc. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Back up, bro. Personal space. <laughs> Breath smells like doctor, which isn't bad. I like. I like doctor. Go on. I don't know where to go from there. <laughs> <laughs> you hate everyone. <laughs> uh, Dead drop. He may have a good reason to be paranoid. He does. And maybe God, zoom out, please. Times it's made our agents jump through these unnecessary hoops. The dead draw is a mailbox with a rails. It's a common means of communication for us. So keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper counter sign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. Do we want to get on this good side? You can trust me with this. I'll get it done. Just don't bollocks it up. Bollocks! Bollocks. I like this guy. A second ago, you didn't like it. <laughs> but he uses the word bollocks. <laughs> and not be many people use bollocks. That's true. That's true. Okay. Look at that monster. Okay. <laughs> I don't like how he gets all up in our face. I'll get it done. You sound rather convincing. There we go. Stockton is a prominent That's because I have high charisma. <laughs> the dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. All right. Mouths in games are hard. Mm -hmm. At least not so. So let's activate the, uh, the mission that requires us to build a teleporter. Does that allow us to talk to people? Yes, that'll allow us to start that mission. To Tinker Tom? To whoever it tells us to, Glad which hopefully is... Oh, no, it's Desdemona. Desdemona. Glad to have you aboard. Before you joined us, you wanted my help with something. I'm listening. <laughs> Deacon's walking around staring at us. I have plans here to build a signal interceptor that can get me I into the Deacon. Institute. So Look at Deacon in the background. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I'm mm. the center of this conversation. I have no hair. <laughs> Still some dope-ass glasses, though. The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. The Interceptor can hijack their signal and send me instead. We've spent dozens of years in too many good agents' lives only to discover not a goddamn thing. And now we have the answer thanks to you. Teleportation? That the Institute could build something so... Deacon just wants to be in the conversation. Yeah, he is very, very full of himself. I want Dr. Tom to help you in any way possible to get this device built. All right. I think next episode we should talk to Tinker Tom in his dank ass hat. All righty. So, 
If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you leave a like, a comment, and a subscription down below if you haven't already. And we will see you guys next time on the Nerd Network. John, give him something to think about. Nobody cared! And we will see you guys next time <laughs> All right. on the Nerd Network. Oh, jeez, I'm still going to reload that. <laughs>